Good morning, dear students and parents. Welcome to a new week, week number 23, 23 for bachillerato. In this week, we are going to take all the information from the ficha mensual. Well, I'm going to share my screen in order to explain and illustrate to you what are the activities. Activity number four. For this week, we have two activities in just one. Activity four, the earth song. The earth song is the general topic. We have some questions. Do you know any songs that talk about our planet? Second one, read the lyrics from the earth song by Michael Jackson. Okay, hope you have listened. This music is very wonderful. This is from Michael Jackson on 1958, 2009, right? Uh, they have uh, information about culture. Michael Jackson was an American singer, songwriter, and dancer too. He was a very influential figure in the pop music in the late 20th century. He's one of the best selling music artists of all time, selling over 350 million records worldwide. His legacy will live on forever. Okay. King no conoce a Michael Jackson, King no lo conoció. Eh, de una u otra forma, su música siempre quedará ¿no? en la historia. We have uh, some vocabulary about this one. The most important things of this activity is that you uh, follow the song okay, and the lyrics and practice your pronunciation because it's an easy, it's a pretty easy song. Okay, and you have a many new vocabulary. Okay, based on this one, we have should that the meaning is lost. Okay, weeping, crying, glance, look, una mirada rápida, drift, a la deriva, travel slowly without destination. Okay, ir a la deriva. Uh, well, we have in addition more new vocabulary. For example, uh, you pledge una promesa. Eh, what about all the dreams? Okay, todos los sueños. We have to glance, una mirada rápida, drift. Okay, in addition, eh, we can eh, highlight more, more eh, new vocabulary if you want. I have noticed. Sunrise, amanecer. Yeah, okay. Eh, what about the what about killing fields? Okay, is there a time? What about all the things that you said were your and mine? Okay, it's very interesting. Okay, follow the songs, very nice. And the activity number five, we have just one, but we have three questions in one, almost four questions. Answer the questions below in complete sentence. A. What is the message of the song? Eh, se supone que ya debiste haber escuchado, que yo sé que la has escuchado. Ok. Trata de tener la idea. Ya voy a presentar el de Word Document eh, eh, y para que veas cómo desarrollarlo. Second. O letter B. Do you think songs are a good way to raise awareness about the environment? Why or why not? C. If you can, listen the song. Ok. Once again should be. That is how some words are longer than others when singing. Do you think listening to music is a good way to improve your English? Right. Let me share to you the word document. This one. Okay, don't forget to do something like this in order to give your information on your, your digital portfolio. Okay, you write your name here. And the person, in this case, first or second or third. Bah, okay, bachillerato. It depends on your level. Okay, well, we have the information here on the description. I already post um, the YouTube video, the official video, okay, without the lyrics because you have the lyrics here and practice as many time as you can, okay? Uh, you have the questions that you already uh, showed. 
one. Do you know any songs that talk about our planet? In my case, yes, I do. Uh, I remember the, the song, uh, The Air Dies Screaming, okay, by Campbell, and the famous one, Save the Whales, okay? Sorry. Save the Whales, by the famous country, Joe McDonald, okay? It's an all one song, okay? But it's pretty nice, okay? Uh, probably you know more than this one, okay? Just write as many uh, you know. Second one, read, read the lyrics from the air song by Michael Jackson, okay? I already read the culture uh, information and the vocabulary too, okay? Uh, remember, in this activity, you have to read, not sing, okay? Then you are going to sing, okay? First, identify new vocabulary. Uh, what about the, 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 the new words? Any kind of grammar that you don't know? Okay, what about sunrise? What about rain? What about all the things that you said were, we were to gain? What about killing fields? Okay, is there a time? And so on, okay? Practice. And then you are able to sing a following song, okay? Well, and the next day, you need to complete the next activity, activity number five. And you are going to answer those questions. Okay, what is the message of the song? Okay, you can start in this way. The song is about how the earth is. Okay, this is your work, but it's an example. The song is about how the earth is suffering and telling, and telling us that uh, it is uh, in danger, for example, yeah? yeah that is your uh, homework. Next, you have, do you think songs are a good way to raise awareness about the environment? Why or why not? Okay, simply, do you think? Yes, I do. Or no, I think? Yes, I'm pretty sure or so on. But you need to say why, okay? Well, in this case, eh, la pregunta es bien clara. Piensas que las canciones eh, de, de alguna manera no son buenas eh, y levantan el, la conciencia acerca de, del medio ambiente, ¿ok? ¿Por qué y por qué no? Ok. Eh, a manera de ejemplo, yo puse esta respuesta. As far as concerns, songs which give good advices, ¿ok? About how to save the earth, the environment, recycle, and etc., ¿ok? And more are always good and interesting to listen every moment, ¿ok? En lo que a mí me concierne canciones eh, las cuales dan buenos consejos acerca de cómo salvar la tierra, eh, el, el medio ambiente, eh, reciclar, y etcétera, y más, siempre van a ser buenas e interesantes para escucharlos en cualquier momento, ¿no? Eh, for example, about the, the song from Michael Jackson, The Earth Song, ¿ok? It's pretty nice song. Um, finally, you have... If you can listen to the if you can listen to the song, notice how some words are longer than others when singing. Okay. Do you think listening to music is a good way to improve your English? Aquí tenemos dos preguntas en una, ¿no? En este caso, eh, la primera, eh, si te das cuenta como algunas palabras en las canciones eh, son más largas, ¿no? Son más largas. Cuando empieza, eh, eh, hay unas, eh, depende de la intonación, de intonation. What about sunrise? What about the rain? Okay. What about all the things that you said we were to gain? Yeah. In this case, eh, hay unas que tienen eh, short and otras que tienen long sounds. Okay. Unas más extensas y unas más cortas. Yeah. En este sentido, podrías responder a manera de ejemplo. Sure. Based on the lyrics, basado en la, eh, en la letra, based on the lyrics, and intonations are words which the singer sings in long and short sounds. Indeed, in effect, I can notice and realize about the correct pronunciation. In addition, ya de aquí empieza la segunda pregunta. In addition, I'm really positive that listening to English music helps people to improve the pronunciation and lexicon. Cierto es que la, la, las canciones 
Eh, pero más que nada, lo más importante es de que sepas lo que estás cantando, identifiques el vocabulario, ese sería el léxico, el léxico, ¿no? Porque una cosa es, es cantarlos y repetir lo que la canción dice, pero otra cosa es que sepas lo que estás diciendo, ya sea en, eh, ya sea en inglés o en cualquier otro idioma. Por eso es importante. Eh, en mi caso, estoy muy seguro, I'm really positive that listening to English music help people eh, en mejorar la pronunciación, ya, porque ahí te das cuenta cómo pronunciarlo, ya. Eh, no es lo mismo, por ejemplo, decir improve o improve, que ya sabes que en una canción puede decir improve, ¿ok? Y la pronunciación y el léxico. Cuando sabes lo que significan las palabras, sabes entonces cómo, cómo, de, eh, cómo decirlas, cómo pronunciarlas y demás, ¿ok? Practice eh, as many times as you can. Um, and let me know any questions, okay? Thank you, thank you for your attention. See you next week. Remember that this week we have two activities. It means for Thursday and for Friday. If you are able to do it in just one day, excellent. Good luck, thank you.